So welcome everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome to this Flow Code uh, webinar where we're going to learn a little bit more about what Flow Code is, some science behind it, and hopefully answer some of your questions along the way and give you some clarity. Also to note in the chat, I put in my email and it's flowwithleona at gmail.com. That way if you have any questions and you want to connect afterwards, you want to know more about Flow Code, or you even want to try a Flow session, I offer five sessions a week. And the sessions are a little bit different. We actually get to experience the Flow state. We actually are going to be immersed in some different techniques and triggers that you get to have the opportunity to experience it. So welcome, welcome, welcome. I also want to just share a little bit about myself before we get into the webinar. I am a Flow Code Ambassador and a Certified Flow Code Coach, Certified Nirvana Coach, and I've also been in the personal development field as a Certified Life Coach for the last 10 years. So I work one-on-one, -on -one, I work in group sessions, virtually, in person. I also lead wellness retreats around the world and I have done a couple of wellness retreats online. So when Nirvana and the Flow Code came along, it was perfect for me to integrate into my current business. So I had more value to add to my client's experience. I also love to lead flow sessions because for me, it's perfect because I get to keep moving through this flow code work, which is progressive. It's um, something that takes a uh, consistent work at because what we're doing is creating a flow personality so we can experience the state of flow more often. So if you're not understanding that, hopefully you're going to have some clarity as we move through this and you will have opportunities to ask questions. So welcome and thank you so much for coming here. I am going to share my screen and show you the webinar page. There we go. Voila. I am currently in Paris, France. That's why we got this. You saw that the time was a little bit different for some of you. I'm actually from the west coast of Canada and the first person in Canada to become a Nirvana instructor and a flow code instructor. So I think I'm going to like try and take over the world. I can't do it alone. So I'm welcome that you're all here. I love this. So here's what's going to happen. We're going to really be conscious of our time and try and stay within the hour because I think that's just a lot of time and there's a lot of information. I'm not going to share everything. That's why I break it up week by week. What we are going to talk about today is I'm going to introduce you to what the flow state is. We're going to talk about the science behind flow code just a little bit, not all of it because there's a lot that is encompassed within the flow code. We're going to talk a little bit about the flow personality and how that is mapped out. And we're going to do some flow triggers together. We're going to do some practical part together so this can be a little bit interactive. Don't worry, I'm not going to get you to jump up and down and stuff like that. We're going to do some cognitive and vagal flow alignment. Then at the very end, I'm going to walk a little bit through the flow hub and I have a gift for you because you've come here and you've dedicated your time and energy. And then if you're interested, the last five minutes is just a little short video to show you how you can also become a flow coach if that interests you. So I hope that you stay on and please um, bear with me because sometimes technology is a little bit sticky. So what is the flow state? The state of flow or being in the zone is a state of peak performance. It's the most desirable state that you want to be in. It's just like a fluid stream of optimal perception and optimal experience. It is a state that we're always seeking. So you know that state that you could be in when you are um, being creative and you're so in the zone and you are writing and it's just like coming out. That is a flow state. There's something going on on a deeper level. You are so immersed in the task at hand. You are, have laser focus or perhaps you're an athlete. And when you are in a race or you're training or there's some kind of intense situation going on, but you're completely immersed in it, 
nothing else exists. That's another example of being in the flow state. You can also experience it. What the flow code does is we're trying to train you to be in a flow personality where you can experience this optimal state more often and for longer periods of time. Now we can't sustain it all the time because you'll see when we're looking at some of the science, the flow is actually like a wave and it's moving. And we can though trigger it so we can have it when we're doing anything. For example, we may be gardening or we may be in a stressful situation and we'll, we can do a trigger and put ourselves into a flow state and change the whole chemistry that's going on in our body. And there's so many benefits to that. And we'll go through that as we're sharing. Let me know if I'm going too fast. I don't go through all the slides here. These are, there's a lot of information. But what flow code is, it's actually a roadmap to the flow state. So they've set up all of the um, necessary, well, as most as they possibly could, scenarios, triggers, different uh, rituals, breathing techniques, so we can trigger ourselves into the state of flow. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to share a video with you so you can see a little bit of what I'm talking about because the videos are so beautifully done. Let's just make sure I got the right video. Here we go. I'll make it a little bigger and we'll just share this. Flow code lesson number two. Flow code presentation. Flow code has been developed by world-class experts on psychology, kinesiology, and flow states, as well as many other areas of expertise to create a revolutionary system of simplified principles, rules, and interventions that are proven to facilitate and sustain the state of flow in different circumstantial setups. Underlying principles, established formulas, and intervention channels are providing a scientific and practical backbone for understanding what flow state is and how it works. Flow code decodes and maps the principles of flow and serves as the roadmap for creating and maintaining the optimal state, becoming a trait on an individual and group level. Advances in neurobiology have clarified our understanding of what is happening in our brains and bodies when we experience a range of mental states. This sharpened perspective allows us to understand in simple and rational terms the mechanics of transcendence. When we enter the flow state, we experience what is called a transient hypofrontality, areas in the prefrontal cortex that we seek to downregulate in order to achieve flow are the seats of higher cognitive processing, where we distinguish the difference between self and other, our sense of time, our internal dialogue. This is why when we are in flow, time seems to slow down. We merge with our consciousness we become one with what we are doing. The research concludes that transient hypofrontality is the unifying feature of all altered states. Flow code consists of a clear and scientifically supported topological framework of trigger channels and interventions that serve as tools to trigger all the needed conditions to assure optimal flow experience. The basic intention is to establish a mentally and emotionally safe perception framework that consists of different methods of dissolution, boosting the experience of flow to a whole new level. Flow code maps all possible channels that can be used to create conditions for flow. Sensory flow alignment with vagal, sensomotoric, chemosensoric, tactile, thermoreceptive, auditory and visual flow alignment. Cognitive flow alignment entails intentions, rituals, recall triggers and flow personality mindsets that create a perception framework in which flow can manifest itself and flourish. By adding social flow alignment triggers, flow code takes flow from individual to a group level. Flow code also puts great importance to environmental flow alignment by reestablishing our lost connection to nature as a natural way to boost flow. The core essence of the flow code is a concept of flow personality which is a central cognitive framework that creates, builds, or sustains flow. Building up a flow personality is based on the progressive development of flow experience, establishing an internal machinery of fulfillment and joy, an experience of perception that is empowering, 
meaningful, and worthy. On the other hand, if we perceive reality mostly through fear, we become prone to vast varieties of ever-changing pathologies, dissatisfaction, dissonance, depression, and other mental disorders. Flow Code recognizes and deals with flow as a recurring wave and not a fixed state or episode waiting to happen now and then. In the body, as in nature, everything works in cycles. Flow is no different. In this way, it creates an immense breakthrough in understanding how to create and maintain the state of flow on a way more coherent neuroscientific basis and time-tested training principles. Flow Code ensures the optimal programming of the flow wave by implementing scientific training principles like balanced challenge, recovery, regularity, periodization, specificity, individuality, and variety principle to experience as much flow as possible in any given activity. It gives us a clear base ground for more effective approaches toward programming flow one can use daily in a variety of situations. By applying flow code principles, any activity can become an activity experienced in the state of flow. Flow code principles are available to anyone who wishes to boost their overall potential and live with a meaningful and fulfilling mindset, experience freedom and transcend in ways never even dreamt of. Fabulous. So, oh, hi, Tyler. Hi, Siva. We see some other people here. Fabulous. That's great. Um, what I wanted to mention about the flow code was just kind of bring it back to a personal level for a moment. In my business as a life coach, I work a lot on the subconscious and I'm working a lot. I work with energy work as well. So I was working on the mind and the spirit and I knew there was another physical component. That's why Nirvana attracted me. When Flow Code came along, it packaged everything up so beautifully. There were little missing components that I required for my work that, and for my personal life. I found that this was already laid out, is easy to use, easy to implement, and so it this progression with the flow code really um, became so easy because they had already done all the hard work. So I was really, really excited about that when I'm just kind of writing some, making sure I have you guys here. Thank you for being here. Um, so what I want to do is I'm going to go back. I can easily get distracted by bright shiny objects when I see other beautiful people in here. <laughs> just me. Um, it can look overwhelming at first when we're looking at how it's mapped out, but it really isn't. When we go into the back end of the system or we're going to later discuss the app, it's quite simply laid out for people. So don't get overwhelmed by when you see this, how it's mapped out. It's just a way of taking all this beautiful information and showing it in a, in a map and a chart. So we already talked about how going into the state of flow, we're actually leaving this part, the prefrontal cortex, too much French today, sorry. <laughs> and we're just, it's literally that expression of getting out of your head is kind of, is what's happening. And we're in a state where we're not having to think about things. We're just, the, the brain waves have changed into this alpha theta wave state. And, um, there's neurons being released and chemicals being released in your brain. We talk about what does it feel like to be in the state of flow. Now, I could play the video and I'm not going to, I'm just gonna go through these slides because right here you can see, these are the components that make up the flow personality. These are some of the characteristics. When you are experiencing the state of flow, you are having that feeling more often of being at one, you know, that being in unity. So when I'm doing my sessions, I have them laid out where I've combined Nirvana, meditation, breath work, and we're experiencing this more being at one. There's no such thing as fear. It doesn't exist when you're in this state. That place where you're being so critical, that has disappeared you feel more playful and joyful you're you've got you're just so deeply immersed and then time just disappears this is like an encompassing feeling of the flow personality and i can share with you that after 
four months of doing this consistently, at least five times a week for me, has considerably changed my life, my well being, my mindset. It's just a beautiful, beautiful experience. And I think everyone should be experiencing the flow state more often. Obviously, that's why I'm a flow ambassador because I think it's the best thing. Why not? Um, I'm not going to go into all these components that we just talked about. Just um, there's some beautiful quotes here. We are so focused that time we just lose track of time. We're so in it that nothing else exists. So I know if you've ever had that moment where you're so engaged in a piece of art or you're writing, like I said before, or you're doing some kind of sports where you're so in the zone. Nothing else exists except that moment. And we need to be more and more in that state because it takes us out of not only fear, but stress, anxiety, depression. You will experience all the opposite of that more often. Or if you are experiencing those negative emotions, you can use one of the triggers and it will pull you out of it quicker play well I could go on and on just about just about this one mindset here of playfulness um, it shifts everything if you know how the energy energies on the planet work you know that the power of play is probably the most powerful state of mind that you can be in when we approach things from this playful mindset so we have within the flow we have different trigger channels that we use sensory flow alignment, cognitive flow alignment, social flow alignment, and environmental flow alignment. Now, environmental flow alignment, you know, that would be great if we could be outdoors all the time during these times, times where we've had to stay more indoors. I had to pivot and say, how can I use that trigger to assist with getting more into the state of flow? So I'll share that with you later. But these, all these flow trigger channels are all different pathways of intervention. So we're actually reprogramming you to, with the triggers and when then we're anchoring this into your consciousness and into your body, into your energetic field, your physical field, that when it happens like this, when you do one of these triggers or you hear the music or you hear about the breath work, when you're doing it more often, you're going to be back in that flow state. Hopefully that makes sense. Um, I'm going to play this little uh, video so you can see. I'll stop my share and play this video. Is everyone okay? Does anyone have any questions right now? They want to stop me? Or are they good? Let's see who else came on. Because we'll have an opportunity to answer those, answer any questions, or put them in the chat, or email me at flowwithleona at gmail.com. So let's see this video, because if you haven't seen this video, it's a very well worth it, just a couple minutes. It's taking its time, obviously. <laughs> Flow code lesson number 22, Flow Trigger Channels. Hi, this is Max Flow. Let's check the flow trigger channels that are used to create conditions for transient hypofrontality and subsequent experience of flow. Flow trigger channels are pathways of interventions on the perception of the individual. They serve as a tool to trigger all the needed conditions to assure optimal setup to experience flow. Basic intention is to bring the perception into the realm of total immersion, into the present experience, and establish a mentally and emotionally safe interperception framework. It consists of different methods of disillusion. Flow code recognizes four main channels of interventions, sensory, cognitive, social, and environmental flow alignment channel. Let's look first into sensory flow alignment or influence through perception senses. Any activity that embodies or creates incoming stimulus perceived by the body is a driving force to induce hypofrontality. While all senses are included in designing flow interventions, the basic intention is to overflow perception with incoming information 
from the body's sensory network and create a sense of deep embodiment. Cognitive flow alignment, influenced through internal cognitive activity, ability to recall images and impressions and being able to modify them to experience more flow-prone mindset is an excellent source for flow experience. It is essential in terms of creating, maintaining a basic focus to seek out and experience the state of flow. Social flow alignment, influenced through social group context. Humans are social creatures. It's just more fun to do anything in a group. It keeps the motivation going and it boosts the experience of an individual flow. So doing it in a group helps us to get the flow and stay in it. Environmental flow alignment. Influence through enclosing environment. Being in nature, especially near water, makes us healthier and happier, reduces stress and brings us peace. The electromagnetic resonance of the body will be affected by the Earth's natural electromagnetic field, and eventually the two will resonate harmonically. Just a short little video to talk about the flow trigger channels. I'm going to go back to our slideshow. Okay, so sensory flow alignment, what does that include? Well, the main basis of sensory flow alignment, like the biggest one is the vagal flow alignment and that is the breathing that we're doing. What kind of breathing are we doing within the flow code? And if you're familiar with Nirvana, you'll be familiar with this and we're gonna have an opportunity on the practical part to do some of it together. There's also the auditory flow alignment. That's what the sounds, the voice, the music. So what flow code has done, they've already put that together in a little package so you could use it in different scenarios. And uh, say for example, that um, I wanna go for a walk and I'm gonna plug in my flow alignment, the auditory one, some music, and then I'm going to do some breath work along with it because I'll be cued to do it. And I'm going to show you an example of that as well. I can now have these two triggers that are working. They're going to help me trigger more of the state of flow. So that's just two. We're always trying to create an optimal setup. And by combining more of these uh, elements together, we just have more of an optimal setup of more opportunity where we can experience the state of flow and go deeper into it. So we also have the chemosensory flow alignment, okay, where we talk about smell and taste and we have visual flow alignment, the thermal receptive flow alignment. We have the tactile flow alignment and sensomotor motoric Oh, I can't even say that one today. Good job, Leona. <laughs> then we we go into the flow personality alignment. So flow personality triggers boost the flow personality growth. Like I talked about before, we're doing this more often so we can create a flow personality. The goal is to establish an overarching worldview paradigm, a perception filter, creating this new reference point. So we're getting you out of the state of fear, more into the state of joy, love, peace, you know, sometimes even just a neutrality. So we're shifting the paradigm. We're working with mindset rituals as well when we go into this. Social flow alignment's great. So if you were doing this in a school setting, a work setting, a yoga setting, a Pilates setting, a gym setting, a, any social environment, and you could actually do little flow code sessions where you're gonna find that people, so that all these elements are put together to set up the best environment. Um, people will become more productive, more creative, uh, more engaged. Or they're going to feel like more appreciated. So there's so many places we can go with the flow code map that we have. Our environmental flow alignment. I mean, it's always great. I'm sure a lot of you have experienced that. When you're outside, you just start to shift. When you're in nature, you just feel yourself shifting. You could be in a bad mood. You go outside for a walk and things start to change. I know for me, when I go close to the water, that's the most optimal place I can be. So when I started sharing my flow sessions this 
spring. I was like, well, how am I going to bring in the environmental flow alignment when we all have to stay inside? So what I did is I pivoted really quickly and I shared some of the videos that Flow Code has that are already showing the landscape. They have water playing in the background. That was an element that I could share through a Zoom session where everyone was just feeling like and imagining that they were outdoors. So there's always a way that you can use these and pivot. We're always looking for the optimal flow setup. Okay, we're starting off always with the intention to flow. We are just these, this is the optimal flow setup. Now we can't always obtain it. And I'm going to see if we have enough I'm looking at time here. If I should play this video, we can't always have all of these elements present. The more we can, the better. Um, if you're ever interested in coming to one of my flow sessions as my guest, you can email me at flowwithleona at gmail.com and you can see how I'm setting up a flow environment so you can experience it virtually. So here we are at a place called the Flow Hub 7. It's the Flow Biohack portal. Oh, is somebody else on here? stop sharing for a second does somebody have a question hello Akash I just I'm just gonna okay good Lindsay hi Lindsay so we're just about halfway through the flow code presentation just going to get into the practical part a bit and in the flow code we have it's not like an app but it's an application that we can use on our computer or we can use on our phone, and I have like a shortcut on my phone, where I can go in there and I can access some of the triggers, which is really useful. So if I can't do a class or you can't do a class, you can access the app and um, you can do some of the triggers in between sessions or just when you're going out for a walk or you just feel like you need that extra boost. So I'm gonna go back and share that screen again so you can see when we, we're going to go in here we're going to do a practical part about the breathing the breath work so when we're doing our breath work and those nirvana instructors will know we even have a couple of flow ambassadors on here it's all about the breath so i say to my people when they're doing a session with me or we're doing the movement part and the movement part's too difficult just focus on the breath work for now so it's always about first the correct posture Okay, how, whether you're sitting or standing and doing the breath work. So right now I'm sitting and most of you probably are. So you can do this with me. And we're gonna sit up straight. We're gonna look straight ahead and our chin's gonna parallel with the floor. Okay, so we want that. We're gonna, it's a diaphragmic breath that we're gonna be doing. So if you want, you can put your hands on your diaphragm or even in front of your mouth so you can feel this. So when we inhale, that belly is gonna expand out. Okay, it's gonna go out. So if you put your hand on there, you're gonna feel it when we do this exercise. And when you exhale, that diaphragm is gonna come in or the belly is gonna come in and the diaphragm is gonna come up. When we're exhaling, we're gonna be, I'll show you in the next slide, we're gonna be exhaling through pursed lips. So there's a reason why we do this. We're inhaling through the nose. We're gonna exhale through pursed lips, almost like you have a straw right here. There's a reason why we do both of these. When we're inhaling through the nose, we are filtrating the air of allergens and irritants. We're also creating this warm and moist environment that's doing like an, a conditioning of the air. Okay, so when the, it forms in the air, this nit nitric oxide is I can't speak today. Good thing you can read it too much. It's sterilizing and opening up the airways. So then when we're exhaling through the purse lips, this opens up the airways. There's an additional workload on your body because we're narrowing through our lips and we're going to do slow and controlled exhale, forcing our body to adapt to this new breath. Because here's something you may not know, is that probably 80% of the people on the planet are breathing wrong and they're doing shallow breathing. And this shallow breath is causing us to be at dis-ease. It's causing stress, it's causing 
depression, it's causing your body just not to function properly because you're not getting the proper oxygen into your body, oxygenating the cells so they can do their job at fighting viruses, keeping your immunity strong, keeping you at the in more of the joy state or love state instead of fear and anxiety. So there's a lot of benefits for proper breath work. And when I do the breath seminar, help me, I'm gonna have some water. <laughs> we go into the science about that, but just a little bit, we're gonna do a little exercise together after this. When we're doing a flow trigger, what's happening is that there's a cue that happens. And so when we hear the first cue, we're going to inhale through our nose after we hear the cue. And we keep inhaling until we hear the next cue. And that's when we exhale through our lips, emptying our lungs. And we keep exhaling, exhaling until we hear the next cue. We inhale. So when you're practicing this, you can practice by putting your hands on your diaphragm. So when you're inhaling, really push it out and then exhale. And what you're going to find, and a lot of people find this when they first start doing this work, is that you're going to actually be sore around here because you're working those muscles. Like you're really giving yourself a workout just from the breath work. I love it. So here are some examples of different breath work that we do. We can do some slow breaths because remember, we want to have less breaths because we're already breathing too often and too shallow. So the whole idea of the triggers is to slow us down, training our body to have more oxygen coming in. So I'm going to share with you, I think, the dolphin breath. Now the dolphin breath, you didn't stop share, the dolphin breath. Breath can be a little bit challenging, but so worth it. So in the dolphin breath, what's going to happen is I'm going to play the little video clip and you can follow along and do it with me. We are going to listen for the cue, take an inhale, long, 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 long inhale and hold our breath. And we're going to hold it for 30 seconds. And then we're going to do a really good exhale and, and really pull in that belly and that diaphragm, lower that diaphragm and get all the air out just so you can experience what this breath is like and i'm just going to do the one breath I, i'm not going to do the full sequence but i do want you to experience part of what we would share within a flow code session when it comes to the breath work so everyone is to hear voila So follow along, you're gonna hear music, you're gonna see a visual. So you could do this when we do our virtual sessions, I'm sharing the whole screen. So you can see me on the video as well. So remember, we're gonna take a really deep inhale when we hear the cue and hold it. Ready, and Nirvana. We would just do some relaxed breathing and then we would do another breath like that and hold it. Did you see me almost panic because I thought the video was going to freeze in the dolphin breath? <laughs> there was a bit of panic in my face. It's all good. <laughs> Sometimes that happens when we're sharing videos, we'll get a leg. I love it. <laughs> Keeping me on my toes. So that is just one of the examples of some breath work. Another, um, Thing, another trigger that we use are the mindset triggers, the mindset rituals. With these rituals, we are, and I'm going to play an example. The science is all happening behind, so we don't even have to think about it. We just have to follow along. So when we are watching this, or you're having someone lead a class or a session for you, you're going to hear the music and the cues. Now, with these rituals, 
You can do it sitting or standing like you're gonna see in the video. But we're gonna be doing some arm movements combined with breath. So for example, and then we're gonna be hearing an intention. So we're working on the subconscious, we're putting new, new words into there, new ways of thinking, positive affirmations. So for example, I'm gonna show you the seven mindsets because we talk about the seven mindsets within the flow code. So when we start out, I always like to start on the heart. I like to get connected with the heart and you're going to hear a cue and you're going to breathe in through the nose and make the movement, hold the breath and you're going to see it on the screen. You'll see it on the screen, hold the breath and then you're going to exhale until you hear the cue to inhale again and you'll see the movement. So I'm gonna share it with you and please follow along and have some fun with this because sometimes we just need to participate and be part of, oh, what a, sorry, I gotta stop this for a second because it wasn't working. I was talking and not, and not listening to myself. <laughs> Hold on, just there you go. Leona. Here we go. The video. Thank you for your patience. Now, what I like is when things are not. And I know no one can see this screen yet, so please bear with me. Let's see what's going to happen here. Here we go. There we go. Here we go. So you can stand up or sit up to do this part. And you see on the left hand side of the screen, you're cued with what to do, whether it's inhaling, which is going to be on a five count. Then we're going to hold our breath for a five count and then exhale. So slow and controlled through those first lips. Exhale while doing the movement. So let's try out just a minute or so of this so everyone can get ready put their hand on their hearts i love this just by doing one session i start to go into the second part so you can see that after you've done this for a while you're not even looking at the screen so at the beginning it's like okay like any other routine you're learning it which is good because you're getting yourself outside the comfort zone and you're learning new skills your brains being re rewired and when you start doing it more often like I can just take myself out of like a tensor situation now and I'm like okay I just need a break I'm gonna do some breath work or I'm gonna do a ritual 
and I can even do it myself. So things are already happening, you know, so I, there's a lot of benefits to having this experience. I'm making sure I have everyone here. We're almost finished this presentation, getting pretty close actually. We're right on time. So let me see if we can get this in the full screen for you. Wow. Uh, so there's other things that we do within uh, the flow code. We do different kinds of meditations and then we're doing some movement. So those of you who haven't seen the movement before, this is combined with the breath work as well. Everything's very controlled and don't be fooled by the simplicity of the movements because when you're combining it with breath, because it can everyone see that or no? I'm going to stop. I'm going to share this next screen. So it's all good. Stop the share. I want you to see a, an example of one more trigger and then we'll be just kind of wrapping things up a bit. Just so you can see what it looks like. Here's an example. So you have an instructor in front of you, or if you had this flow hub, uh, app application, you could be following along as well. So I'm going to show that with you share watch a little bit what it looks like just one example with some cognitive movement flying hero As you can see within these movement movements, you're very controlled and you're moving with the breath, listening to the cue. And you're doing an inhale on the four, exhale on an eight count. And so this is just really taking you out of your head. So for example, when you're doing like a flow session with me, for example, people will come in, we'll start off with the intention to flow. We're gonna do some vagal flow alignment, which is some different breath work. Then we're gonna go into a warm up like a Nirvana warm up, then a movement session. So for example, this month we're focused on the core. And then after that, we're doing some intention to the flow, intention mindset, intentions. We're rolling through that. And then at the end, we wind up with a meditation. So my sessions run for about 45 minutes to an hour. But just to kind of give you um, what that might look like. Everyone uses this different. There's so many possibilities. It's always uh, great to see what everyone else is doing. So this is what we've been talking about is the Flow Hub 7 portal. You can actually use this for seven days for free. It's great because I'm going to show you how you can get that for free as well. You can go to, I'm going to show what you get there. Here you have over 700 flow triggers and programs that you can use. You can access it on your phone, access it on your computer, your iPad, um, and you get to try it for seven days. So how cool is that? So if you want to write that down, it's the flowhub.com. And I'm going to show you how we do it. I'm going to stop the share and we're going to go there right now together. Because I want to show you something. This is what you get. Because of Flow Hub 7. Hmm. Doesn't seem to. Now, let's go back to my screen. I want you to see what it looks like because sometimes when people just talk about it, you don't always get the full idea. 
So here's what it looks like when you go to the Flow Hub 7. You might have seen this already when you signed up for the free live webinars. And you see where it says log in or sign up? You can go there and you're going to get access, show you, to, to try and sign up. Well, I don't want to go into my names. Maybe I'm not signed up yet. Maybe I am, but I'm going to sign up. If I get, but we'll go and we can show you my end. You can sign up that way. Take advantages of the seven day free trial. You can click on that, come here, log in, sign up, get it for seven days. But after that, here's the beautiful thing. I'm going to give you a code so you can get 10% off if you decide that you want to try it for longer than the free seven days. So I'm going to put that in the chat right now. The code is Leona Wallace. So if you can see that in the chat, it's L-E-O-N-A-W-A-L-L-A-C-E. I know I speak fast, but it's right there in the chat. Also, when you sign up and you go and you're like, I want to do this for longer because I love it. It's only like 10 euro a month. And then you could have the 10% off with my code or you can sign up for a year and then you still get 10% off. So everyone likes a little bit of extra sharing an extra love and i wanted to share that with you because you guys all showed up today and um let's see what else like you're gonna learn you can learn how to breathe correctly there's also some triggers in there for uh beating insomnia some information how to meditate in different ways boosting your sports performance creating a different culture within your work and schools. There's so much that we can hack into through the Flow Hub 7. And all the different triggers we talked about goes into depth there. You'll even get access to some of the movement sessions, the strength, the stretch, the balance sessions. And so it's kind of cool that you can access that. If you cannot find um, someone that you can do sessions with right now, this is a great way to get started. You might be saying to yourself, this is the point, this is the place where I'm gonna share with you that maybe you wanna change in career or maybe you wanna add this, you're a Nirvana instructor and now you wanna become a flow code coach or you're a yoga instructor or you're a business coach or you're a life coach and you're like, now with everything changing, I want to add more value to my client's experience. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share with you a five minute video. So if everyone's okay with that and they want to stay with me for this, it's five minutes of your time and then I can answer any of your questions at the end. So, okay, I'm going to stop my share there. Uh, does anyone have any questions right now they want to ask or they have to go or they've got five minutes? Okay, I am going to share the video because it's a great video and it just encompasses everything. Flow Coach Training. Are you ready to become part of an exciting movement with a mission to bring flow to every part of society and create a flow culture that would propel us forward as individuals and as a human race. Then become a flow coach. Get involved with a revolutionary approach to the flow state based on the flow code. A strong scientific foundation that maps the principles of flow and serves as a roadmap for creating and maintaining the optimal state. The flow code connects the latest neuroscientific research with a unique flow state inducing technique that joins the flow state science, breath work, and kinesiology, providing a powerful combination of trigger channels to optimally program the state of flow. Start your own flow coach sessions, work with individuals or groups, lead workshops, and offer comprehensive flow program packages that will make your clients flow. Get trained step-by-step -step online without any hassle. So simple, everything is there for you. All the videos, tutorials, manuals with flow triggers and programs. As a future flow coach, you have two options to enter the global movement of thousands of professionals around the world. Basic Flow Coach Kit or Premium Flow Coach Kit. Basic Flow Coach Kit. 
This option is more suited to new professionals who would like to enter the Flow Education Alliance progressively. Start with a basic kit and prolong your membership with Flow Hub access each year. Premium Flow Coach Kit. If you are serious about teaching flow, we recommend you take advantage of this offer and unlock full access to all programs and features, receive lifetime Flow Hub access and FEA membership. In both options, you receive full education and business support on all levels. Full Flow Code video lessons with all flow related topics covered. Flow Coach Network Profile with all educational materials. Flow Hub membership with 300 plus flow triggers, rituals, and programs. Flow Education Alliance FEA membership. Official Flow Code Manual. Official Flow Coach Manual. Flow PLD Breathwork Technique Tutorial. Flow Workshops, Handouts, and Slides for different end user groups. Complete turnkey marketing and promotion packages. Complete Flow Coaching Programs. Basic, Advanced, and Master Level. Personalized Flow Coach Website with ready offers. Constant Back Office Support. Flow Coach by Nirvana Certificate. License to lead Flow Workshops for different clients groups and corporations licensed to teach worldwide receive expert mentoring service expert educator live guidance technique correction Q&A and general walkthrough via Skype video and that's not all get flow coach and flow coaching service locator listing online flow coach support group global branding and worldwide promotional activities coach discount in Nirvana store 20% flow hub app support with flow programs and triggers what can you achieve as a flow coach attract more clients with completely new life coaching concepts that address the flow state from a unique angle get the ability to solve clients ever more present stress related problems burnout syndrome and depression lead coaching sessions with ease with the support of flow hub programs and triggers work in almost any possible location get complete turnkey solutions get complete step-by-step -step support start in a matter of weeks flow coach by nirvana education course will give you complete training on how to flow coach with a wide variety of options if you are serious about your coaching career and feel the need to fully express yourself as an engaged member, the Global Flow Education Alliance gives you many different career progression opportunities. Upgrade your knowledge and become a Flow Master Coach with specialized target group modules that enable you to work on a higher level within your field. Flow Corporate Module allows you to work with companies offering them several already time-tested and proven programs and packages. Flow Sport Modules, adapted and expanded to meet the needs of specific sports. Flow in public and private education with kindergarten, school, and PE teacher modules. To sign up, go to www.flow.nirvana.fitness and click the register now button or contact us directly at flow at nirvana.fitness for further questions. Did everyone get that? What? Okay, here's something I want to add on a personal level. Since I've become a certified flow code coach, my business has completely shifted. I just got certified in February with Flow Code, and my business has gone like this. Where things are shifting on the planet, people are needing guidance and support in a different way. They are needing to get out of, like, imagine it's gonna not get better for a while. So people are going to need support. So I see a huge opportunity in the wellness industry in the educational industry in your corporation assisting your clients as well now here's the thing there's the two packages the basic package the premium package i because i am a flow code ambassador i have the ability and i've been granted a gift for you if you decide there's two things i can offer you with the same code leona wallace 10 percent off either package but here's the beautiful thing as well. If you sign up with premium through me, I can also offer you a payment plan over the next 
12 months. So if money is an issue and standing the way of starting a brand new business where you get to support other people, add more value to their lives as well, this is a great opportunity. So if anyone's interested, please send me an email to flow with Leona at gmail.com and then we can have a short little session to discuss it. Also, I've been made an official mentor with Flow Code, so I'm going to be able to, it's a little, it's um, a little bit separate from this package, but I'm going to be there to provide strategy sessions, business planning, how to implement this in the virtual world, how to implement it into your current business that you already have, and just um, guide you since that's been my last 10 years of work as well. So I've implemented it all together. So enough of me talking. Does anyone have any questions or anything they need clarity with? I invite you to share. Hi, Lindsay. I didn't see you at the beginning and didn't get a chance. Thank you. Thanks, Talia. If any, if you want Flow Hub Seven, I can gift you ten percent off with the code Leona Wallace. If you're interested in the coaching part and you're still not sure, contact me. But either way, you can use my code. Even if you've already worked with um, with someone else before, if you're not comfortable with that, talk to them. Whoever led you here and said uh, I need to see this. You know, maybe they have a code as well. You know, we're one big family here trying to help the world. Oh, you're from LA, Lindsay. Oh, I wonder how you found us. I'm so glad you're here. Thanks for coming. Everyone, thank you so much for sharing your valuable time and energy with me. I'm wishing you much love and light from Paris. Please feel free to come to another webinar if you want. Much love to all of you. And uh, please reach out if I can help you in any way. It was a pleasure. And be tukey, we say. We say be tukey means be present, be here, be now.